Hey everybody, what is up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can see by the title, I'm going to be showing y'all my brand new purse. Well, it's brand new. I got it back in March, but I'm just now going to start using it. So if you watched my last What's in My Bag um, video, you saw that I wanted to clean that purse out and I was kind of getting ready to move on to a new purse. So yes, make sure you go and watch my old video. And yeah, I hope you're excited to see what is in this video. Make sure you give this video a like, subscribe if you're new. I hope you enjoy this content if you love the girly or just you're curious to see what's in people's bags. Um, please subscribe and join me here. I love doing these videos, they're so fun and people seem to enjoy them. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you my new bag. Okay, so how beautiful is this Anne Klein bag? I got this at TJ Maxx, and it's really different for me. You know, it's not like totally pink, and I just say it's different. Very classy, very classy. I love like this part right here. I love the handle. Now, this is kind of a different color, but it does have a pop of pink on each side. So, yes. I would say like it's about, it's got this handle right here, but I don't hold it like this very often. I mostly hold it like this, if I can get this like this. Yeah, and like I said, it's about a mid-length purse, so it's a good size. Go ahead and show you a close-up. It is Anne Klein. I don't think I've ever had an Anne Klein purse before. Um, yeah, and it was like around 25, 30 bucks, so very reasonable. Okay, now the only thing was, as cute as it is, and as cute as you can see, the pink. Honestly, it wasn't enough a pink for me. Um, so, I had to dress it up with some cute little keychains that I bought just to accessorize the purse with. Just for, not really because I needed keychains. I just wanted to, like, kind of, like, give the purse some jewelry. Just, like I said, kind of dress it up. So, I did want a big pink for... First of all, I want to, so I went, I, and Hobby Lobby has cute stuff, let me tell you. So, I found this one at Hobby Lobby. It is a little crown with some pearls. Um, a very cute ball. I wish, now, I wish it was a little bit bigger, the pink puff ball, but very cute. It was two, either two or three bucks at, Do at Hobby Lobby. And, where did I get this? I went to the Rainbow Bow store, and I found, saw this tea keychain. And that was just adorable. It's very pretty. It's like pinkish, but it's kind of like glittery and iridescent. And then on this side, it's so cute, y'all. It is a little purse keychain. And this was like three bucks at Rainbow. So if you want to like accessorize your purse with some cute keychains, Rainbow is a good place to go for cute keychains and Hobby Lobby. You know how up front Hobby Lobby has like earrings and those like little gifts that's a good place to look for keychains so yeah i mainly got that just just to kind of dress up the pur purse and like you know you know me by now if you've been watching my videos that i love pink so i just felt like this purse is cute but it needed a little bit more pink so that's why i added the keychains so it is a smaller purse than my last purse so i'm pretty much just taking what i need but let me tell you as small as this purse is it really can pack a lot. So I have this, there's a little pocket here. I've never used that. By the way, I've been using this purse for about, I would say a week. So yeah. Y'all, I even wore a pink lipstick for this video. <laughs> okay, so open the purse and I'm just gonna show you it is full jam packed in here. So I'm just gonna pull out what is here. And obviously if you watched my last purse video, um, you're going to see a few things that are the same as in my last purse because I feel like it's it's not it's unrealistic to not expect to when you're going from purse to purse to not pay, put a few of the basic needs the same things in each purse right sometimes I like to get a few new things for a new purse but I mostly stick to the same thing so I'm going to be showing you what is in here okay oh there's a pocket right here also but like I said, it's very stiff. The only thing, I'm barely gonna lift this. This piece of paper is my insurance card for my for my car, obviously. So if I get pulled over, which it seems like in the last, God, the last five years, I've been pulled over more. I had never been pulled over in my life until I, 
I was 36 years old. And it seems like I just get pulled over now. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but anyway. All right, so first I pull out, I got this kitty um, pouch right here. And I just put my change in here, and it's like all change quarters, everything. Mine like quarters, I would say. But yeah, I keep my change in there. Okay, this I have to cover. This is in every purse. This is the debit cards, me and my husband, so I'm not obviously going to show that. Um, okay, I just picked this up a few days ago because I had a really bad headache, and I picked this up from Dollar Tree, this Excedrin extra strength i think it's really important to carry this and important and helpful to carry this in your purse some some medicine if you get a headache and you're like you can't go home right away and get some aspirin like it's good to carry it with you or someone you may be somewhere and someone may ask do you have an aspirin that is like a common question so it's good to have one okay another thing i think this was in my last purse too but i like that it's small and it's this vanilla body fantasies and we were at walmart the other day we as in me and my teenage daughter penelope and i love i think vanilla is one of my favorite scents it just smells so good i'm gonna get the bigger one that they have because i just love 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 that that scent okay so next i pull out this little watermelon container once again you're gonna see a lot of stuff from dollar tree y'all even my nails ooh, even my nails that I just put on a few days ago. Or how cute are they for, for one thing, okay? Um, they're from Dollar Tree. I love Dollar Tree. So yeah, I thought this is really cute. Um, little case. And so in here, I just put like a few things I think that I would need when I'm out and about. I got some floss in here. And um, I put some band-aids because you never know what could happen. I told this story before, but um, a few years ago, I had to walk because my car was like broken down. So I had to walk to the bus stop and I fell in a huge hole and I skid my knee and there was blood everywhere and I had no band-aid. So just saying, it's smart to carry a band-aid with you. And then the last thing I have in this little bag, which I probably don't need, but I got cotton swabs. Um, just in case like you have like makeup, you know, mascara, eyeliner, you know, sometimes, or food, sometimes things end up in different places. So, I like this little bag. I, I think it's, look how pretty that is. That is so perfect. And honestly, this could be like a little, the only thing about it is it's so small, but this could be like a little, if you just wanted to run into Walmart or Dollar Tree and go just put your debit card in here, some cash. This is really cute too. So, yeah, I can get it off. Okay, next thing. Okay, so this is a new thing I bought. This is eyeglass cleaning cloth. And I thought this was perfect. Once again, got this from Dollar Tree because my eyeglasses that I have to wear to drive have a lot of smudges on them. So I thought that's perfect. I need that really bad. Next, I think we've got a few receipts. Okay, this is Dairy Queen. Receipt, you can barely see it. Me and my daughter got some shakes. And I told her, don't let me get strawberry shakes anymore because they're really good, but all the sugar, it really just did. I didn't feel good after I had it yesterday. I gotta stay away from strawberry shakes. Um, another receipt. What is this? Dairy Queen. Oh, we got two Dairy Queen receipts. <clears throat> Now, this thing is really cute, and I haven't actually started to use it yet. This actually came with the purse, um, and it is a little, it says Ancline, and it is a little, um, just a little thing you put your debit cards and stuff in, and it's got a keychain to it. Obviously, I would never hook this up on the side of my purse, though. I would just leave it inside, but perfect place. I'm going to... Um, transfer my, some of my cards to this because this is just too cute and it's that baby pink so that was really cute that it came with the purse okay so again i got my car keys dodge keys okay another thing i threw into my purse was my nail glue 
my kiss nail glue um because i did these i just think this is important to have in your purse if you do fake nails acrylic nails like me um this is something i just started in january was getting into nails um yeah if you get these like this is so weird because this hand all the nails have stayed on this hand since I did these nails, but like three of these nails came off the other day while well, I was doing a lot of like work, heavy duty work, but three of these nails came off and I just glued them back on that other night, but I just thought if I'm out somewhere and wanna glue them back on, I can just have this uh, Kiss nail glue in my purse. But I think that's very helpful. Another receipt, Dairy Queen. Dang, I got three Dairy Queen receipts. Um, I got my hand sanitizer, Bath and Body Works, Champagne Toast, and this was in my last purse. You probably saw it. Um, I'm good on hand sanitizer until I run out of this one, so yeah. Okay, and then I got my keychain. This is actually a useful keychain that I actually have keys on, um, and it's pretty correct. But um, yeah, I got my dad's house key because I house sit up. We're gonna be house sitting again soon. And then I got, obviously I got my key. But yeah, I keep this in my purse and not, I've learned not to keep important keys obviously on the sides of my purse because sometimes I have, I'll look down and a keychain is gone. I've lost it. So I always just keep the house keys in the purse. Okay. We got a dime. It is hot in here, y'all. I don't know about air conditioners on. It feels hot. Okay, and I got some cash. I got some ones, and I'm pretty sure that this is five dollars. Left over one, two, three. Yeah, Dollar Tree money. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't use cash. Well, sometimes I do. I would say I mostly use my debit card. But yeah, that is everything that is in my new purse. Once again, give y'all a look at the purse. I love that, isn't it cute? So at Rainbow, they had one of these. There was a heart that was glittery like this, and there was also a purse. And I asked my daughters, which one should I get? And they both agreed the purse. Once again, I'm gonna give you a look at the, the keychains. I just feel like the keychains add to this purse, add to the girly effect. Cause as, as you can tell, there's just like little pops of pink. Pink isn't like, it's not overwhelming on this purse. So that's why I just thought it needed keychains. And let me show you the inside. And that is the inside. So, like I said, it's not a huge purse, but it's also not the tiniest purse you've ever seen either. So, yes. Oh, okay, one more thing also I wanted to show y'all. This is something, oh, and I love to keep my, a chapstick in my purse. I've been using this Cotton Candy Lip Smackers that I've had forever. I love Lip Smackers. I found this new one that has SPF 30, which I think is great because it's summer. This is Kiss Therapy um, and it's grapefruit. So that is what it looks like. And I thought that looked really, really cute. Let's go ahead and smell it. So I wanted to show y'all um, something I wanted to keep in my purse. I just think the packaging is really cute too. Please don't let me break a nail. I don't want to break a nail. Okay, so here's the little container. Like I said, grapefruit, lip smackers, SBF 30. And let's go ahead and smell it. Oh, and it says when it expires, 2020, February 2025. Well, that's good. I've already got some chapstick on, but let me just smell this. Mmm, it does good. It does smell good. I wish y'all could smell it. It smells so good. So it's grapefruit. But I do have to say I like cotton candy scent better. But yeah. So really, really cute. And I'm actually about to go on a walk with my kids to the park. It's so hot here. We have to wait till like 7.30 or 8 to even walk outside. But yeah, this is perfect to put on my lips to protect my lips um, while I'm out and about. Yeah. So that is everything that's in my purse. Now I've got to put all this stuff back. I need to go buy paper towels. I love the paper towels at Dollar Tree, by the way. They're so, they're thick and they're really good. I really don't want to buy paper towels from Walmart anymore. Not, not the cheap, cheap, cheap ones we get. Um, okay, and just one more thing. I wanted to show y'all. This is so cute. 
Look at this beautiful cosmetic bag I got at Dollar Tree. I just thought it was so pretty. Yeah, there's the tag. I didn't even look inside it. I keep thinking like I want to travel and like take my makeup somewhere, but I haven't been able to travel so far um, in a while. But yeah, that's it. So very cute. One day I'll have another purse. Well, I have a few other purses, but this is so cute. How pretty is that? Okay. Anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed what seeing what is in my new Anne Klein purse. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it. Let me know if you want me to keep doing these videos. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.